Hello, today we're in Virtual RoboCup Asia Pacific, Go Space Rescue under 12, SG12. About my team, my name is Anna Mohammed. I have 10 years old. I am from Egypt. I live in Organa. I started to learn robotics three months ago. I participated in a local competition and I won the second place. What is my challenge task? I participated in Go Space Rescue under 12. Sometimes the robot was going in the trap. I mean that when the robot sees a trap, it goes backward with a turn. The robot didn't go in the trap again. Now I learned how to make the robot avoid the trap. Analysis. Challenge task. Analysis. I needed to program the robot to avoid the trap well. I used RGB sensors to detect the yellow. And I make that when the robot have loaded objects more than one, and by using position X and Y, and the exact front ultrasonic sensors turn to zero compass. Now the robots can avoid the trap one. Now, you will see how the robot avoids the trap. Look, now the robot is going to turn and go, turn and go in to the trap and avoid. And you see, the robot avoided the trap. And now the robot is going to the deposit. As I told the robot, when it sees the purple color, it needs to turn and go to the deposit and deposit. AI algorithms and resources. Identifying and prioritizing and assigning the necessary AI algorithms, tools, and resources to complete the challenge task. I needed to program the robot to go to the deposit when the loaded objects are more than four. I used RGB sensors to the purple line color and I make that when the robots have loaded objects, more than four turn to zero compass. Now the robot makes deposit more than before. I was using some of the C language, as you see in this picture. Now let's see how the robot goes and deposits. See, now the robot is going to the purple line and it turned that it's now depositing. Now, this is the flu chart. First of all, we start. Then the robot scans the sensor's value. Then if the condition is true, we will continue to the action. And then we will finish the action and we will go to the end. Debugging. The robots have good performance as I planned. In the last competition, the map had the purple line under the deposit. And I make the robot when it has more than three, it goes to the purple line and the deposits. And I took some of the C language and the key action. I make that when the robot has loaded object more than two by using the blue color scissors and position X and Y equal equal one, 
two to 180 degrees. Then the robot will take more red objects. Conclusion. It was good that I got 1,190 and then it evaluated to 1,430. I made the robot take more super objects to get a better score. Using compass and X and Y position and making the robot track the wall and taking super objects. By making both to using C language and less speed. Learning experience. I share share your Kuspi's learning experience. I learned how to make the robot take objects and deposit it and avoid the trap. I participated in a local competition and I got the second place. I shared with my parents how the robot deposits and take the objects. Thank you for watching my presentation.